All right, dude, you know the Noid from Domino's? Yeah. He, he reminds me of, like, that. He reminds me of the dude that would go, like, like, he'd show up to, like, a, like a, a Domino's and be like, I, I got to shoot the place that Noid told me to. I got a what? Like, the, you, ever, you ever seen that story? Like, um, the, is it, I'm saying that right? The Noid from Domino's? Yeah, they avoid the Noid. Yeah, you remember that? I made a guy go shoot up the place. Oh, Did wow. Did it really? You don't know this? No, I don't know. The Noid no longer exists as a character. I in... remember some crazy shit happened, so, right? So Domino's were doing a, a commercial. A and promo, he, using, promo using a, a, a character, character called the Noid. Yes. yes. Mm. And yeah, avoid a... the Noid, who annoys you uh, fucking up your pizza. Yeah, see if you can find a commercial. Play it. Avoid the Noid. The Noid hates hot quality pizza. This is See, Dylan at the stand. <laughs> you hot pizza. At least I'm at the stand. He's just coming on the crowd. Right? Call Domino's Pizza and avoid the noise. I didn't mean that, Josh. Hello. It's okay. I love you, buddy. We keep the cold out and all this quality in. So when you By the way, when... When um, well, you can keep playing, it's fine. So that's that. It's yeah. fine. Uh, when companies do that, they create their own character so they can keep as much money. Like they don't have to like. And that, that gets popular, like the um, no like the Coca Cola polar bear. Mm -hmm. Hey, oh, we could put Tony that on merch. Tiger. Yeah. Exactly. Like you know, obviously yeah. more money. But that commercial, I don't know if it was that exact commercial, but someone, I'm like that Titanic dude. Someone saw that commercial and thought the Noid was talking to them. And went to a is it a Domino's or a Pizza Hut? Can you find the story? I was just gonna say. And he like, uh, and he went and shot it up. Mm. The Pizza Hut. Uh, I think it was either Pizza Hut or Domino's. But he was like, I don't know what his reasoning is. But I think it was like he's banging pizza. on Pizza Hut. That's what he's doing. I hope dude. nobody takes you like that with Gas Digital, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be I'd be lucky. Noid. On January thirtieth, <sighs> Kenneth Lamore Noid. I, mean, I love these people. Oh oh oh! I love these people that think his last name was Noid. Oh. And he was mentally ill. Oh, so when he saw no. Avoid the Noid, he was like, dude, you they're making fun my of life. me. You've ruined making, my life. Yes. So armed with a, uh, oh, oh, oh. a, a so armed with a point thirty I don't know how to say guns. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know I don't gun to guns. <laughs> I'm red state all the way, but I don't know guns. I just shoot them. Uh, Magnum Nord then held two employees hostage for over five hours after ranting to the employees that the, the owner of Domino's, Tom, was fraudulent. Tom, Tom from Gas? Owns Domino's? That makes sense for all his money. Was fraudulent and had stolen his name. And he, and he forced them to call Domino's headquarters and demand $100,000 and while limousine as a getaway transportation for him. Oh, after, limo. Uh, after offering the exchange a hostage for a copy of American post... What? Postmodern Post -modern author yeah. Robert Anton Wilson, 1985 novel, The Widow's Son. He asked for a book? Am I reading? Did he asked for a yeah. book? Fucking nerd. Noid then became hungry and forced the captive employees to make him two pizzas. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. That's so funny. It's funny to be like, y'all making fun of me. I I'm getting hungry though. <laughs> by the way, uh, by the way, that was the first pizza Domino's ever cooked that actually was under 30 minutes. <laughs> it's at stupid. gunpoint. It's just like, yo, dude. We <sighs> now I know why it's so why good I though. Why did you put a like a African American in inflection on the uh, accent? Because his middle name was Lamar. No, actually, I don't think I did. did that. I feel like people think he does that. He does that. Yeah. I, well, he did it, I thought he that. did it specifically <laughs> for that. <laughs> no, I, actually, I think Noid is a super white dude. Noid lives matter. Noid. How did it end? Can you guys read, David? Read this. I'm so read sick of this. fucking reading um, He <laughs> was charged with kidnapping, aggravated assault, extortion, and possession of a firearm. He was found not guilty by reason of insanity. <sighs> that means, and he that means, spent time way, in a mental... He, he, died, he killed wait, himself. Wait, wait. He spent time in a mental institution, died via suicide on February 25th. Damn, dude. Even he, had, even he had to avoid the Two noise. after my birthday. <laughs> even he had a dip. That sucks. That and, is wild. Uh, that incident say, was... Um... Rest in peace to a real world. Oh, yeah. So, so yeah. when that happened, Domino's was like, we can never use this character again. Yeah, no. Because, you know, there's too much bad like fucking press with it. I don't think <clears throat> things are talking to them. <laughs> it's called schizophrenia. No, no. Most I of those people, nobody talks to them. Hot take. I don't like schizophrenia. Exactly. So why the fuck would this person be talking yeah, exactly, to you? Don't no, nobody bro. talks to you, but this person on TV sending you a message, bro. It's like, what the fuck is wrong with people, bro? He definitely took it personally because he was like, avoid the noise. He's like, the people do do that. Yeah. People and, do do that. And he got triggered. He probably went to like CVS or something and people were just like, he was like talking to himself and people were trying to avoid him. He's like, it's like, oh, that's because of the commercial. It's because yeah. of the commercial. It's like if you talk about a stock, like if a celebrity mentions a stalker's name publicly that was stalking them, yeah. don't do that because you might trigger them and they might think it's a sign yeah. to come back yeah. or whatever. You see, the problem with the world right now, back then it wasn't as bad. Back then they were like, all right, fuck it. We just won't do this shit anymore. Now, 
people act crazy, we accommodate them. Yeah. We yeah, adjust yes. we adjust our reality we gotta be crazy. to make things better yes. for people who are fucking completely nuts. Mm -hmm. And there's nothing you could do to make the world more compatible for someone who's yeah. fucking nuts. You know what everyone's doing? Everyone is gaslighting themselves for crazy yeah. people. A thousand percent.